What's going on guys, JK Flash and yeah you're briefing on finger so so I'm using the Huawei B40 Pro uh, on the selfie camera to do this vlog today so basically I'm in the rain so I got hooked up looking like a gangster and um, I'm out with the family but yeah we came out just to get some snaps so basically the idea is, is that we're going to use my EOS M on just as a full frame camera so basically with the uh, adapter makes it a full frame so it's a cheap full frame camera that's it basically it's really awkward with the cameras here yeah. But, right, let's crack on. Let's see a bit. So we uh, got quite a cool picture of Amy here, as you can probably see, look, it's pretty sick. So yeah, the things I'm using my uh, Sigma 10 to 20 mil, so basically it's for crop sensor, but when you zoom in a little bit, it goes obviously a bit wider. So yeah, obviously we'll crop the image on the corners, but decent, like it. Yeah, enjoy that chip, man. What? <laughs> what did you say? Enjoy that chip. <laughs> What? Jensen, are you having fun? Jensen, Jensen. hello! Oh, wait. Hello! Look, Daddy's got the camera! You having fun? <laughs> you remember having fun, look. This, this is for yes! Yes? Shake your head for yes. Mummy, it's not going yet. Okay guys, so we are back. So, we've been at Leon C and as you can see when I was walking along in the rain, I've still got my head up because I'm soaking wet now. And it makes me look like a bit like a Jedi. Do you know what I mean? <laughs> right, sorry guys. So, I had a bit of a technical difficulty there. It's a bit of a mad one. Right, so, as you just saw, so we was at Leon C, we got some snaps using the EOS M. So, yep, let's have a look. Okay, so the whole point of this video is just to explain that I'm using the ESO M just for photos today because it is basically a full frame. So, once you add the speed booster, there you go. So, it is technically, I'll get this off, a Super 35 sensor. But then when you add the speed booster, like so, as you will probably know about, it makes it, it basically makes it, it magnifies it to become a full frame. But the problem is it's not an actual fully full frame. It's a little bit smaller. I think when you calculate it, you have to calculate it by 0.71. So I think it's just a little bit smaller than an actual full frame, but you get the gist. So I did take some photos on with the trusty Nifty 50. Let's have a look, we get some sensor. So, yep, so there you go, that's with the Nifty 50. And, um, and I did a couple of shots using my, this is a 10 to 17, I would say, 10, 10 to 20 mil. Um, doesn't want to pick it up, there you go. This is a 10 to 20 mil Sigma, trusty. Uh, got this off my friend Luke Curtis, well, good old trusty mate there. So, yep, so, the problem with this, this this lens is a crop sensor lens, so let me show you what happens. So, when we go there, look, it looks like you're looking through an eyepiece. You see that? Because you get the vignetting. But I pushed pushed it in a bit. It kind of still there, but it's quite it's quite nice and wide. So you can go to about, I think what, about 20 mil, 70 mil. And yeah, it still works. So this looks really weird. I'm looking at this now, and you can see it on the screen. This is actually quite cool. But yeah, the whole point was, just to show you guys that it's not just a good camera just for raw video it's also good to use as a natural camera so it's actually really small once you if you run around with, with an SD50 on it's a really nice compact little camera look did he and obviously I've got a extra handle there just to make it look a little bit more cool on that turns in gear focus see but once you took that extra handle off it'll be quite small but yeah, I actually think this is probably, if you're really interested in getting full frame photography and you're on a budget, this is what? Legit, like legitly now, it's about 200 pounds. So you get, at least you get in 1080 video. So like you could buy like a Canon 5D Mark I, but you're gonna get no video. But with this, you'll get basically full frame photos and video, and you can shoot raw, and you can also get 
nice deals. So my little my little boy decided to attack the tripod. I think he thinks that like every time he sees it, it's like a little I don't know, jungle gym. <laughs> so yeah, I just wanted to say to you guys like it's fantastic. Like just don't think of this as a just a video camera. It is a really cool photo camera. So I really enjoyed playing with this today and yeah hope you enjoyed the video so please like subscribe comment all that should bang and yeah hold tight stay tuned and i'm here guys coming back i'm here on it Ladies.